So you're thinking about purchasing a home, you've already made the decision, now what? This video is for you. You've already decided you're gonna make a purchase. Now, what do you do? The first step is to get pre-qualified. And if you know that you're gonna pay cash, you might wanna to talk to a lender and get pre-qualified anyway. Why? Because the rates are super low, though they are kind of going up now, and it's other people's money. So you might as well give it a shot, find out what your financing options are, but also you might have the ability to borrow against another property and do what's called a home equity line of credit. So I think whether you're paying cash it's always a good idea to explore your options. Now, if you know that paying cash is not gonna be an option for you, speaking to a lender is 100% the first step before you even start looking at properties. Because why waste your time looking at something that you don't know if you can't afford or want to afford? Also, going back to if you're paying cash, as you've probably seen in this marketplace, prices are going up. I don't think that's going to happen so much as it has back in 22 and early 2021, but things are to be seen. And you might say, I had a budget of about 1.5 and I really can't get the property that I want. So you have to go up another, let's say $200,000. And you don't really want to do that. That's not an ideal scenario. By no means am I a financial advisor, but one thing that you might want to consider is to reevaluate your portfolio. Real estate has always been a great investment, especially in Florida, as more people are coming down here, it's warm climate, you can't create more waterfront property, and there's so many tax benefits to moving to Florida, so we're seeing the state just continue to appreciate, and that's expected to be the case for a long time. So if you're looking to place your money in investment, real estate is always a great opportunity. So maybe look at your current portfolios and start to evaluate what, what things are underperforming. And maybe there might be some money that you can pull out of that market and put it into the real estate market instead. Just a thought. So just to recap, you've decided you're gonna make a purchase. Now what are you gonna do? Speak to a lender, talk to a couple, find out what your financing options are, what you might be able to do with your current equity in your home, and also look and talk to your financial advisor what some of your options might be for pulling out additional funds. Thanks so much for tuning in.